It has been over three months since Typhoon Nocton struck the Philippines. The storm was particularly devastating to Caraduanes. Fortunately, volunteers have been making regular visits to help families rebuild. At the end of March, city volunteers successfully completed the fifth aid distribution since the disaster. It has been three months since the typhoon hit Caraduanes, Philippines. Siji volunteers are well known by the community here and they are now carrying out the fifth aid distribution since the disaster. Residents patiently await the distribution. The governor has also come to participate as a volunteer. This is a great help for those that have lost their houses. If you notice, many people have already begun purchasing the materials to help repair their homes. It was Christmas last year that Typhoon knocked and struck, destroying homes and crops. Volunteers were dispatched from Manila, traveling by bus and boat to reach the disaster area as quickly as possible to distribute goods and financial relief to victims. The total amount of aid from Siji is nearly three times that of local government. <laughs> We will definitely make good use of this money. Of course, people will use it to repair their homes. There is no better use for it. Local volunteers also took the opportunity to make visits to families in need of special help. This volunteer named Ingracia brings rice and a special pair of shoes for this resident, Pedro, who was born without forearms or lower legs. These are not your average shoes. Because of their special design, they're suitable for Petro to wear. I would first like to thank God. It is like he called for Tsuji to come and help us, especially coming to help our town, San Andres. Volunteers also visit this old blind couple, bringing rice and blessings after the neighbors inform them of the old couple's condition. I introduced a couple to the Tsuji Foundation since I knew that Tsuji could help them, since Tsuji helps other families in need. Over the course of four days, Tsuji was able to help 3,360 families during this distribution, with 20 kilos of rice given to each family along with emergency relief funds to help them repair their damaged homes.